Welcome to myprojectbazaar.com Learning approach for identifying disease treatment relations in short text. The machine learning field has gained in momentum in almost any domain of research and just recently has become a reliable tool in the medical domain. The empirical domain of automatic learning is used in tasks such as medical decision support, medical imaging, protein-protein interaction, extraction of medical knowledge, and for overall patient management care. The machine learning is envisioned as a tool by which computer-based system can be integrated in healthcare field in order to get a better, more efficient medical care. This paper describes a medical learning based methodology for building an application that is capable of identifying and dissemination healthcare information. It extracts sentence from published medical paper that mention disease and treatment and identifies semantic relation that exists between disease and treatment. Our evaluation results for this task show that the proposed methodology obtains reliable outcomes that could be integrated in an application to be used in medical care domain. The potential value of paper stands in machine learning settings that we propose and in fact we outperform previous result on the same data set. Let me see the flow for the machine learning approach project. Machine learning approach is a natural learning process. First, admin have to upload the medical HTML file. From the HTML file, the extract text from that file. Then we applying stop word. Stop word means this, uh, like uh, the and a like prepositions like that words. Then we gonna apply stemmer stemmer means that the, the word is end with shun production we have to shorten the word production into product then uh, introduction to intro like that we just shorten the words then uh, we extract the medical related data like uh, the caution uh, treatment and symptoms of the disease. Then we collect the data and store in the database. When user querying a disease like a, a cancer with head age, like that some example query, then we have to extract the semantic words like a cancer, head age, this important word. Then uh, search for the disease which is stored in the database then uh, retrieve the result and display to the users next and the file it's web based project so you need uh, any server here we are running the project in glass based server and use the wam servers backend database We have used MySQL database for the storing the data. Server is loading. Just a moment. Project is running. First, we have to register. Click on the register. 
then you enter the details first name like a sample user and password one two three and choose a database data book user type I choose doctor then click on register now the user is registered we just log in using that email id sam login if the credential invalid we need show the message sample at gmail.com Uh, your home is open then you can edit profile here we have to upload the disease html file first choose the html file there are various disease files are here and i choose uh, kidney disease this is name kidney disease then add the disease here first before the extraction of text this is a html file the text is extracted from the html file removing the html tags here then removal process here the special characters are removed from this text then stop word we applying stop word like the and and the a like prepositions it takes some time wait until completion of loading The stop word is applied. Here, look, there is no preposition here. Then semantic extraction. Here we applied stemmer and semantic extraction. This is symptoms. This is cause and treatment. Now store the data. Now the uploaded files are listed here. Here a new file, kidney disease. These are the files. Now search the disease like cancer, that age. the user query cancer with heritage the stemmer word here with this removed then stemmer heritage like the a the word is removed here then results the abdominal cancer brain cancer it display the related disease which is given in keyword That's all. We can search it again. You can log out here.